Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West Channel. I know that you're getting tired of seeing the flint and steel ignited ash tenders, but I had to try this one last attempt, which is t-shirt material. So not gonna need all that. Let's just cut off a little square of it. Any tender that you saturate with ashes will turn that tender into a coal extender. But what I did not know is that it'll also allow it to accept a very weak spark a very cool spark, like from a flint and steel. I wasn't able to, to get tulip poplar bark to ignite, even though I processed it down very small. And I was not able to get uh, white oak sawdust to ignite, which surprised me. But I think any of your standard coal extenders, saturated wood ashes is going to work. Like your bracket fungus and your plant pits and, you know, the standard coal extenders. I think we have ignition. That appears to have ignited and gone back out. I think that's too much ash when it does that. Do y'all have QT gas stations in your part of the country? And I napped a sharp edge on this chart. When I finally got some sparks is when it ignited. And you can go ahead and put more ashes on it after it's ignited. All right, y'all, do me a favor. Before you leave my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and in that drop-down list, select all. And do give the video a like. I appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one.